So that was the first kind of portion of part one of your procedure. Now the second portion of part one is going to involve using your volumetric flask and a graduated cylinder. What you're going to do is you're going to carefully transfer this approximately 100 milliliters. You're going to transfer 50 milliliters of it into your graduated cylinder. Once you've done that, the remaining solution here you'll discard into the appropriate waste container. That is, well, this is an, a sodium chloride solution. So you'll discard this. Once you've discarded it, you're going to take the 50 milliliters in your graduated cylinder and transfer that back, back to your volumetric flask. You will then add deionized water to bring this up to 100 milliliters. So what we did basically is we've made the solution in the volumetric flask one part of your initial solution, one part deionized water. So the amount of NaCl that was in there was cut in half. So this is known as a dilution. We've cut the concentration, we've cut the amount of NaCl in half, but the volume, the total volume is the exact same. You're going to do that a total of two times. So you'll do it once, evaluate whether or not that substance conducts electricity, and then you'll do it again to see if that second dilution conducts electricity. Now the amount of NaCl that I did in this video was one gram. The amount that you're going to do will, in your lab period will be told to you by your IAA.